What is up guys, Shinchi42 here in today's video of Rise of Kingdoms. It is the stage one of the Eve of Crusade event. So what we had to do here, we had to defeat some martyrs so that we can get the Worn Leather Satchel. So in this video, I'm going to open up all my Worn Leather Satchels and then we're going to collect all the parchments that are these. So there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven different types of parchments that we need to collect in order for us to be able to obtain this Kingdom Supply Chest. So in this kingdom supply chest, when you open this, you will get a massive amount of rewards. And I can't even tell you guys how massive this is. This is going to be the best event there is so far in this game. And the rewards are incredible. So we're going to consume all the worn leather satchels. We're going to collect those parchments and we're going to convert those parchments into the kingdom supply chest. And then we're going to show the rankings of the continent right now. And also, I'm going to tell you guys how I have been collecting all of these parchments and how I've been successfully doing this. If you want to see regular contents of Rise of Kingdoms, this is the channel for you. Subscribe and turn the notifications on so you will not miss out any regular contents that we are producing in this channel. And also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in the video. So first, I'm going to tell you guys how I have been collecting my worn leather satchels. So if we look at the uh, amount of worn leather satchels we have, I have currently 629 worn leather satchels and still collecting all these worn leather satchels. Let's go and collect these. So I've got eight here, eight more. All right, so let's go ahead and defeat this martyrs. So this is what I've been doing. You know, I have about four dispatches and I've, what I've actually done is I've put a bunch of different types of troops in one. So there is no single troops in here so that the moving speed is going to be relatively fair from everyone. And I try to um, like, especially if I have El Cid, I try to make sure that if I have El Cid there, he would have a different uh, units as well, not just archers. And if I had the Minamoto and Tao Tao, there would be some infantry there just to balance the moving speed. So what I did there is that so nobody can get ahead and fall behind when they're marching. So everyone's going to attack all at the same time so that the HP of each unit that I dispatch will be relatively be close to each other. And I don't have to keep sending them back right away. So, okay, so this is what I did, and um, I, I've been keep on consuming a lot of action points so we can get a lot of these parchments and get the Kingdom Supply Chest because it's massive amount of rewards, and it's really worth it, really good for free-to-play players. So I do want to give you guys a tip here. Um, don't go over 1,000 in your action points. I mean, don't even go over 1,000. Like, don't even get to 1,000. Just get about 500, maybe six, 700, and just don't get into 1,000 because if you reach 1,000, you have no room for regen of your action point recovery. And also, it says here that no action points will be returned upon cancellation when current action point totals exceeds 1,000. So if you cancel, let's say you have to do something and you have to cancel, now you're not going to get that action points back. So you just wasted a few action points there. So be careful. Um, make sure you guys read this information here so that you know you can be utilizing your action points at the most efficient way. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open the Wern Leather Satchel. So we're going to go and open 600. 42 of these worn leather satchels so i'm excited hopefully we're gonna get a variety of these um, parchments and um, hopefully we can use all that to convert into the kingdom supply chest let's go ahead and use them we've got 90 86 87 84 94 104 97 wow this is a lot this is really good Hopefully this is going to be very beneficial for us. So to understand how you can convert all these um, parchments into this kingdom supply chest, you can see that we have to collect each one. So if you're missing one of the piece, you're not going to be able to convert it to the kingdom supply chest. So what we can do is we can look at the lowest amount of parchment. So we can see that I have 86 here for the mausoleum of Halicarnassus. So what's going to happen here is that I'm only going to be able to convert this 86 times because after 86, I'm going to run out of this parchment and then I can't convert anymore because there is no parchment for this. So what I need to do is keep, you know, defeating those marauders and get the uh, satchels and then get some parchments and hopefully that I can get this specific parchment so that I can convert more and uh, get more kingdom supply chests. So currently right now I rank 999 plus, I guess. I don't know where I stand. Um, I only have 75k points. So if we look at the kingdom ranking, this is the kingdom ranking right now. So you can see that kingdom 1, 2, 3, 0, um, ROK1, Pure Leaf is leading with 1 million. I don't know how they did this. Um, really good grinding for them. They have a lot of time to uh, push through. 
um, you can see um, the rankings here. A lot of 1227, really good job for them. Um, I believe they are, yep, they are the leading uh, kingdom in here. 1227 is the leading kingdom right now on stage one. And then 1228, right now we are second in here because I am in 1228. So um, let's go ahead and convert all of these uh, parchments into the kingdom supply chest and let's go ahead and do it. So there we go. So we got to do this 86 times. So that's a lot. And we can see our points racking up as well. All right, so just keep on clicking, keep on clicking. All right, 100K points. Let's see when, okay, so now at 105, we saw our ranking, our true ranking 972, 125. How far can I get, right? How far can I get with this? Hopefully I can get into really close to the top. So um, 86, so I think I calculated earlier about 400K. So maybe about 500K points total. Maybe my math is wrong, hopefully it's correct. Let's see, um, 17 more parchments. Now I'm ranked 569, oh my God. This actually feels nice just watching your rank goes down and um, you know, as, and then you gain more of these kingdom supply chests as well. So after this, what we're gonna do is we're gonna open all these kingdom supply chests and see how much we're gonna get and how massive of a rewards that we're gonna be able to obtain with this kingdom supply chest. So rank 391, 200K points, I got 61 left. Wow. So let's keep keep on, keep on. Uh, I wish there was a uh, exchange all button here. It would be really nice if we do have that. So it would definitely save a lot of time for us. So with that happening, with me converting all those is our, yep, I think our power is going up as well. So right now, 67,195 and 67,195. Let's see how accurate this is. Yep, 67,200. All right, so let's keep going, keep clicking. We got 50 more. Rank 253, wow, keep on going down. I mean, sorry, keep on going up. They just <laughs> invert. Um, 221, 211, wow, 206. Oh, we're getting somewhere here, guys. We're getting somewhere. What kind of rewards do we get? Once, what, where do we need to land? We need to land at least in the um, one, oh, 1,000 ranking you already get. Okay, you get just by participating, I guess, to be if you're in the 1,000 ranking, but how would you know if you're in the 1,000 ranking? If you can't really see but if you were under 100 you would get three legendary commander sculptures um rank 50 you would get five uh 21 to 50 so where are we at right now we are at 187 so hopefully we can get there hopefully we can get close and under 100 i think we will i think there's it's definitely a good chance that we will get there so we got one we're rank 160 154 151 143, um, 140, hey, oh my god, so much, 131, 27, okay, let's keep going, guys, all right, there we go, um, 108, so we're breaking the 100 mark, we got 30 left, oh my god, so it's getting a little bit more difficult to gain points, see, I only gained 4 there, 3, okay, 97, 94, Hopefully we can get to the top 50 at least. At least we're in the top 100 by now. And this is the last, you know, last hour. So this is probably going to be more of a true ranking than if I was doing this earlier. So we got rank 74, 72. I got 19 left, 18 left, guys. And But I'm still going to keep on going and, you know, defeat some martyrs and keep on getting um, some more parchments, you know, so that I can try to convert some of them. Because, I mean, getting all these... Kingdom Supply Chest is super worth it. It's definitely worth it. So, okay, 53, 50. Oh my God, I'm not even moving any rank now. 52. Yes, I broke the uh, 50 mark, guys. Uh, yes, 47, um, 45. Let's see how far we can get with this. 45, okay. 45 is kind of stagnant there. 41, 40, and um, all right, 37. 34. So 34 is our current ranking. So um, we can see, wow, Super Grover 620, 34. So who's close by with us? 34. Um, 1, 2, 2, 6. 1, 2, 2, 8. All right. So how much do we get for 34 again? So we get the 50, right, from here. So I get only 5. So if I can get to the closer to the rank 20, I can get 10. Oh my God, this is so much to grind. I don't know if I can get there. But wow, it's amazing, guys. So I'm still going to be keep on defeating 
these murders so that I can get some, you know, more parchment. So we're going to keep doing that. And um, here, we're going to go collect this. Let's go ahead and open some more. Actually, let's see how much we're going to get. All right. So let's see if we got those. Let's see. Yeah, we can convert one more. 32. All right. But that's, that's just not, um, you know, not looking into the individual uh, points. We're also looking at the uh, overall total for the kingdom. So, all right. So let's go ahead and open 93 of these kingdom supply chests. And what are we going to get? I am full of uh, excitement here and see what is in store for us and the surprise that we're going to get. So um, 93 kingdom supply chests. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and use it. Wow. Um, we got an event there. Uh, achievement that we just finished. Interesting. And we've got three of these three day speed ups. Wow, that's massive speed ups. Um, what else did we get? We got some 500 gems, 22 of these 375k stones, 500k food, 20 of these. Wow, for the 1.5 million stones, uh, some gold, and 1980. Wow, that's a, that's a lot of speed ups. That I like it. Well, wow, oh my god, and um, in individual credits, more gold, and some books more food wood and more resources and we got three of these 50k um level seven tome of knowledge oh my god so much speed ups guys 24 hours eight of these wow. <laughs> this is so worth it i love this event i love this i love the rewards totally worth it for all my action points all i need to do was grind so all i need to do was to be active and grind and i'm getting all of these amazing rewards um you can see that we're getting golden keys as well um Wow, so 1.125 million stone and um, 17 three hour speed up. So, wow. And then we also get some gems in here. Um, really, guys, the big thing here for me, the big takeaway for me is all these speed ups. And it's massive. And the, really, the bottleneck in this game is your speed up. Having all these speed ups is definitely going to help me boost. Oh my God. So, I'm super excited to boost now. I just need to wait for a perfect event and we're going to boost and use all these speed ups. So before I forget to tell you guys, each time you guys defeat a martyr, you can see by looking at the rewards, you can see that you will be getting 55 at the bare minimum, I think. The bare minimum is you get 55, or I don't know if you get more, but you get 55 of the resource tiles. A lot, that's a lot. And then you get some speed ups as well. Most of the time you get seven. So sometimes you even get five minute uh, training speed up that at a time seven. So that's a lot. And you get books. You can see, let's take a look at another one. You see 55 of these resource tile, seven minute. It's pretty consistent. And uh, 55 resource, uh, level one resource pack, pretty consistent for the resources and speed up. Amazing, guys. You are getting a lot of benefit in here just by defeating them. So make sure that you guys participate in this event because the rewards are massive. Even if you don't convert everything in the kingdom supply chest, just by defeating them is so good. Plus, you're also getting some experience points by doing so. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and I hope that you guys are successful. And uh, let me know what is your highest ranking in the event for the stage one. And um, let's see how much points you also have. Um, do you guys have a higher points than me? So let's do another exchange in here. So now I'm ranked 30 with 530k points. What is your ranking? Let me know in the comment section below and I'll see you guys again next time. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up.